Today we're going to prepare our sphere for squash stretch or animation. So I'm going to use the ball that was previously created. The first thing that we need to do is add an armature to the ball. With the ball selected, I'm going to add armature. The armature has been created. We need to make the armature the same size as the ball, so I'm going to change that to 2 meters. There's our armature. Let's rename that to sphere control. We need to be able to see it in the environment. I'll change to an X view. Go to the object properties, down to viewport display, select in front. Now we can see the armature is now part of it. Selecting the sphere and then holding down on the shift button, click on sphere control, go to object, parent, parent with automatic weights. The two are now connected to one another. Let's go ahead and go down here to the object constraint properties and select maintain volume. Change to the Z for our free axis and if we want to do a squash stretch on the Z axis the ball will now squash stretch in its parameter. That'll allow us to move into animation next.